What? I did not know that. Today our control in the deck goes move here back with another Russian badge reaction. Today we're doing when the $10 YouTube poop outsells Call of Duty, which I believe is going to be about a lethal company, I, which I believe he said at the end of his last video, which was what, scamming or robbing a game for $124 out of a free game, which I believe is a World of Warships video. You can check my reaction to that video, I'll leave it right up there. Also link down below in the description. Also in a place on my channel with all my other Russian badge reactions. Go in a chronological order if you want to binge watch through all of those. But he said there was a lethal company video, and at the time uh, Lythero had just uploaded his like two hour long lethal company video and i knew nothing about lethal company at all so then like i think a couple days later i went and watched and re reacted to like there is video now i've actually streamed lethal company a couple times which is actually pretty cool and i enjoyed the game quite a lot and i've actually been reacting to smitty playing it which should be a video that's either before or after this one i'm not really sure patrons get all my videos there early do it all the month get you all my reaction videos there early could not do this if it was not for them i do read our comments leave some down below but let's go ahead jump into it uh this lethal company video all Lethal right. Company is like an Easter egg hunt on a minefield. I heard a squelching. Oh. <laughs> if that minefield was also located on a shooting range. Uh huh. Oh god. Oh yeah. No, he's doing. Haunted house crawling with and bracken. <laughs> Every time I turn around in my house late at night, I expect a bracken. Of capitalism. Is this what minimum wage is like in the United States? Yes. <laughs> the company picnic. As a $10 game made by a furry in his basement, I am morally obligated to play it. So my knee I think he's doing pretty good for himself. And my mailbox unpipe bomb. Of course, Toddy drops that. He's like, he's a furry too, Lamar. I know I'm late to the party. I know you've already seen tons of videos and tons of streams, but well, I can assure you, I was late this to the party. Is most but I've been reacting to it. Worse. Hey, Bada, does this sound like an air horn to you? And if you don't mind, I'm just going to yap about it for 40 minutes because I'm dying uh -huh. to tell you why I'm in love with this YouTube poop of a in game. In his last video, he talked about Call it. And I was I really like, well, <laughs> I got to watch my favorite video. Double jump. Nice. This video is sponsored by Swouse, my brand new merch collection on sale for a limited time. But I'm not going to tell you about it for like eight more minutes because I don't want to interrupt the story. Okay. I kind of so need to look into started. that. Okay, so there's this company called The Company that puts a metaphorical gun to your head and gives you two choices. Make Only money for the company. I don't speak German neither. I'm here for money. Money. Or if that doesn't sound like your style, your second option is summary execution by the company. Uh -huh. Company picnic. The game was rigged from the start. Is that a reference to something? Money required to avoid your execution is called quota, and it doesn't matter how silly or how scary things get, it is the New only thing, thing that matters. Yep, that sounds about right, because it's the bottom line. I'm waiting for the core. You're going to be summarily up. executed into the void of space if you don't get a quota, right? <laughs> this may seem like just another boring five-letter word, Q-U-O-T-A. No, nope. cares? It's the more you play this game, the more you realize it is so much more than that. You will experience horror oh, beyond God. your comprehension the haunting. in the name of quota. I've streamed it a couple times. It's <laughs> something. Can you just look you at the bracket? You will your best friends in the name of quota. Shut, shut, shut up, baby. Get the subs. Shut up. Fuck. But they don't work on sound, they work okay. off site. Fuck you, fuck you, it's getting you, it's getting you, it's getting you, dog. I just gotta outrun start the you. Ship. Start the fucking ship, put the keys in the ignition, <laughs> please. Hear me loud and clear, and I mean loud and clear, when I what? say it's quota or die. Yeah, I mean, yeah. yeah. <laughs> quota is achieved by stealing. Repurposing Re random junk from quote abandoned industrialized moons that I can assure mm -hmm. you were abandoned for a reason. Uh oh. Yo! Because flying earthworms. <laughs> this crap officially. And you know he's gonna find mods, right? Because it makes absolutely no sense. What makes no sense is this <laughs> nuclear powered reactor I'm holding it's is like worth 87 less bucks. than a rubber ducky. A jar what? of pickles can be worth more than an engine. A lamp can be worth more than a nuclear reactor. Even the bodies of your dead teammates technically have a value. And in case you weren't it's already five dollars, each and every one of yeah. you is worth five whole credits. Why does this game That's cool more than I thought it would be? Five human beings for a jar of pickles. <laughs> right. I bought you a gift. Yo, what's up? Hunger. A jar of poop? Pickles? <laughs> Those are. Wait, that's his favorite body. He played with important. like Thero. But weight is even more important. Like, there's the no way like Thero isn't in this. The more it drains your stamina and hurts your regen. Which, in a game about sprinting away from things that want you dead, is important to keep an eye on. You can close doors on them, right? They can't open doors? Oh, they can't they open, can open doors. They can't open doors. Dipshit dumbass <laughs> spider can't even open a goofy odd doors to open doors. Oh, God. <laughs> the spider has right opposable thumbs. I would hope five so. Five basic movements you'll make while scrapping. I like to call Spidey or Dipsy. Dancing, interrupting. Interacting, pointing. Loaf. I saw uh, a monster out there. Scanning, <laughs> which is super important for spotting loot and bad guys, so spam that shit. And why? Yeah. 
Yapping. I think it goes without saying that you do a lot of talking. Proximity chat is survive. awesome. Aren't preachers like professional yappers? <laughs> I mean, they yeah, 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 I find more two-hand stuff. Horrifying, but it's kind of soothing at the same time. Other crap is, is two-handed, which means you can't access your inventory, climb ladders, or pick up anything else. With a perfect example being, but that was worth. Oh the yes, most. yo, scream it as loud as you can. I want to hear it as loud as you can. <laughs> yo, you God, are we gonna have had. another uh, sprite incident? <laughs> In the last video, we kept. Cracking mm. open cans of Sprite. Of quirkiness when it comes to scrap, and the apparatus is a prime example. This mini nuclear reactor is what is powers the like entire that? facility you're looting, so once you take it, all the electricity is gone. Which means no more lights and an immediate spike in radiation levels. I love grabbing things. Which means more monster. Day worse. Yeah, pretty big fan. I grab this thing and I ruin everybody's day. Me grabbing my car keys after 12 cores lights. <laughs> Don't do that. Man. I wish this beer would stop telling me to drive. Why <laughs> one of you fucks pulled the battery? Dude, was, I was I'm sorry, is that Master myself. Chief? I was by myself picking shit up, and I was like, you know what? At least I can see where I'm going and, then and make lights. my way yep. back. And then all the fucking lights turned yep. off. Damn, that's crazy. Anyway. You can call me an idiot for so using already found the mods. world's largest, heaviest, most expensive flashlight, but my goals are beyond your understanding. Hey, hold up. Hey, I got a big flashlight for the crew. Get out of the way. Big flashlight coming through. Big flashlight boy on the move. I, could you bring an apparatus to a place that doesn't have one plugged in? simply turning into credits to meet quota, like keys that unlock doors. I got a key for moments like this. And you can lock them behind people. No, that was all mod. <laughs> this mini video is a mess on my mind. My personal favorite, stop signs. So I can beat the shit out of bugs using stolen government infrastructure. I wish an anomaly would right now. No matter the junk you collect, it is completely worthless unless you cash it out for credits to meet quota, which is Bracken. where the terminal comes in. Terminal is the second most important word in this game next to quota, because if I you stop don't know how to use you're it. in trouble. Your ship's landing and takeoff is controlled by a lever on the dash, but selecting where you want to go is the terminal's business. Typing moons will tell you which are available to loot and how the weather is and mm. trust me weather in this game can be a real kick in the dick once you've made up your it's mind you're typing route flood, then where all you that, want to fun. go like the company building so you can cash out your scrap much like all things exactly. in lethal company the hq is also trying to kill you turning in your scrap to the window and ringing a bell will turn meaningless crap into cold hard credits but don't stand too close once the slot opens or you will also be collected well yep oh, yep God. yep you got it <laughs> and there's Assuming the mods you survive the tentacle monster it's time for payday ah! I need a I mean paycheck. The size of this paycheck payday. not only depends on what scrap <laughs> Those you deliver, but when Russian you deliver. On day zero, when quota is due, they'll pay you 100% full price for your items. Mm -hmm. But any day earlier than that, and you only get a fraction I've of the actually value. Seen Sometimes 30 what the cents is. on the dollar. This is a bunch of math is. I don't care about. Yeah. Sell whatever you want on any day you want, no. as long as you meet that almighty number called quota. Assuming you did that... Holy shit, will you finally start having fun? Now that you're no longer oh, a mask baby and you understand quota, And they just came out with a new update, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> with newfound credits come newfound options, a big one being moons. Mm -hmm. Some moons are distant, like the infamous Titan, that costs money if you want to land on them. They are both high risk and high reward, because even though oh, they cost credits, these moons have the best crap and the scariest monsters defending that uh -huh. crap. Hey, what's up, oh, God. Oh, God. Freddy Fazbear. What's up, Freddy Fazbear. Freddy Fazbear. Freddy Fazbear. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. What's up, bro? You're moving trash. <laughs> You said you're moving. I saw four movie? people lined up. Oh my god! How much money did we pay to travel to this place? Uh, the other major option for burning credits: items. And I know you're gonna ask me, so let me tell you in box. advance that you cannot buy beans. Hey, you want some beans? Beans? You can't buy beans. beans. What the fuck? What the fuck? Beans. <laughs> What? <laughs> what the Where'd fuck? my blue dogs go? I mean, you can download a mod if you really beans need beans. Packs? I think you've noticed by now. People love mods. 5,000. No, I think I downloaded the whole <laughs> company. And who needs or the beans right among us. Swow. My brand Swow. new limited time merch that took me two years to get right. And I'll tell you why. You see, why? I'm those perpetually cold MFs that's always shivering his ass off. And that makes car hard live in my like... very best friend. But he the problem with wearing North car hard West, is right? that it makes me feel like a fraud. Yes, yes. yes. If you're wearing a Carhartt hoodie and it's clean, 
You are not a motherfucker that should be wearing a Carhartt hoodie. I do this shit yeah. for a living. I'm not forklift certified, and I've <laughs> never stepped foot on a construction site, so I've got no business wearing the uniform of a guy that works 37 hours a day. 35 hours a motherfucking day. So to break free of this Carhartt prison, I tried uh, every hoodie you can imagine from street I mean, Whistle and Diesel make some good stuff around there, and I found the final form of quality. Hoodie. I didn't like cotton hoodies because they stretch out, lose shape, and gather those beads of lint. I hate that. I didn't like polyester hoodies because sitting in synthetic fabric workout gear all day made me feel like a piece of shit. <laughs> My Swag's hoodie is the perfect blend of See, at least cotton he's with a touch making of polyester, it so it's good quality. Never beads lint, never lose shape, and always just looks just good try to check fresh as the day grab. you bought it. Fresh. Fresh. The design is inspired by my favorite part of every day, which is the time I spend doing dumb shit with my mocap suit and the source engine. Tossing shit, breaking shit, hitting myself in the head with a brick. All the things that make you want to say swow. My cousin Tyler did such a great job with the designs that we decided to make t-shirts and mouse pads too. Oh? I mean, swow pads. I am so committed pads. to the quality of this my person. The first thousand tactics. of you to order That's the entire bad. three item set at the link below will receive a handwritten thank you note from my own goddamn fingers. I'm going to break my hands doing this. You've got two weeks from today to place an order. I have nine more days. At your door in about three to four months. Oh, I wow. Know that's a little bit of a wait. I'm guessing they made sure the order. Everybody who wants a hoodie can get a hoodie. Okay, Unlike that would not limit it. Yeah. Shops to sell out immediately and only a handful of people Because they only get make the a item. couple that's of so them. so fucking stupid. I stand by the quality of my products. You can Cancel or refund at any time, I will give you your money back. And I am begging you to place an order at the link below because this shit is too good to miss out on. Use code Badger for 10% off and thank oh. you for hearing me out. My phone is charging Moving right on now. From swouse to more serious items. Yeah, we gotta talk about flashlights thumb, thumb, because in Lethal Company, you live and die. I'll definitely check that out at the end of the Who episode. Who put a flashlight in the cabinet with one percent battery? I'm gonna crack <laughs> your fucking skull open. <laughs> if you don't have a flashlight to spot mines, so turrets, and monsters problem. lurking in the dark, ready to nay nay your ass into an early grave, you are destined for a life of pain. There's a mine in here somewhere. Wow, there's also this turret. <laughs> oh, oh dad, because no flashlight, no bread alert. <laughs> These things are so critical that if you fall to your death, your teammates will have one thing to say. Damn, I really missed that flashlight. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> See, my problem is that I have two ring lights, a but I'm streaming. There's a and a pro version that is brighter, larger, and has double the battery, and if you forget to recharge it, I'm feeding your ass to a spider. All items, including flashlights, are bought via the terminal and delivered to you with a jingle that is nearly impossible to miss. Apart from flashlights, yeah, no, you everybody's definitely got a tier it. list of what's good and what's bad, and the walkie-talkie is definitely divisive. It allows you to Wait, communicate not like with it, but anybody it takes else spot. anywhere on the map that is also holding a walkie-talkie, but my friends are so loud that I just can't use it. <laughs> Oh, why is that so loud? Well, all of you shut the fuck up. Items can range from useless novelties that provide zero utility. Boom box. Who the fuck bought a toilet? toilet. Yeah. Two items TV. With situational utility like performance enhancing. I don't know what that does. Medicine to avoid mm -hmm. losing all my ad revenue on this video, even though it's apparently a safe and legal combo of amphetamines and helium. Oh, I gotta hit it. Uh, is it gonna move faster? The entire thing. I'm putting flashbangs in this I, I know exactly what that means. Possibly was. useless category. Even though it's funny to flashbang something with eight eyes because it theoretically hits them four times as hard, <laughs> my homies never deploy it correctly on any Does it actually spiders work? included. He's got a flashbang. To your right, to your right. There's a mine as well. <laughs> Mop. Mop. Hey, look, I see. You, maybe it worked. Uh, no, I think it died. You killed it, dog. No, it's it's, dead. it's not dead. I'm walking past this. Oh, no, it's not dead. <laughs> yeah. The only item more likely to betray your teammates than a flashbang is a ladder, because no matter how sturdy it is, Drop. it's yeah. only as safe as the guy that's holding it. Just fucking jump, drop it all. Drop. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> so what is that? Is it a revolver shotgun? <laughs> He's gonna die. <laughs> Just the back. Oh. Yeah, not so funny now, are you? If you want something truly useful, buy a teleporter, which lets you yoink any player you are currently spectating back to the ship. Yeah, but alive. they lose their Warner items. Bought his shoulders. <laughs> this is the they gotta pick all those up. Very important to do that, because the Death company facts. deducts a big chunk of credits for every crewmate you leave behind, but as long as you collect the corpse, you avoid the tax. Okay, uh -huh. I still don't... Uh, okay, Whoa. who's getting excited? Stop, stop, stop! Whoa. There's even an inverse teleporter, which beams you from the ship into a random part of the facility. Uh -huh. How scary Sound. Oh no, it's terrifying, but it's so okay. much fun. All right, let's get into Everybody. They're not going to the same place. That is horrifying that all of them are now gone. The only major mm -hmm. downside here is that items do not travel with you, so it's best to use it for body retrieval or getting a trapped buddy out of a jam. Hey. 
Teleport me out. I'll go back to the ship. I need to be teleported. Okay, don't move. I'm not teleporting his dumb ass. Wasting <laughs> resources. I'm looting other sections of the map. Ooh, what? engine. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> no way. I gotta see what happened. Yo, Loaf, are you good? <laughs> loaf. Loaf, can He's you dead. hear me? Is there a loaf still alive Coil in here? Head? Oh no, spider. That answers my question. I think I'm done here. And with that, it's time to move on from items to cooperation. Because if you, you understand have none teamwork, of it in this game. it'll open a lot of doors for you. This, key, this door? Yeah, open it. No, the other one that says lock, dipshit. <laughs> <laughs> It goes without oh. saying that being friendly and cooperative leads to better outcomes in Lethal Company, but if you ask me, being hostile and chaotic it, is a whole lot It's so fun. much fun. Well, you know what? I think he's a piece of shit, but we won't bring that up. But if you hope to meet quota, especially the larger quota, I think it may be because there's no, like, with your teammates. Gary put super his long end goal to the game. Go off. I don't think it's going to go off. So I think well, yeah, I don't think so. Oh, oh, no, it will go off. <laughs> I think it's because the game doesn't have, like, like kind of an end goal. Hey, hey that is Gary. I thought you said this was tech. I thought you said it was tech. <laughs> Making tough choices is a fundamental part of what makes Lethal Company so addicting, and I'll illustrate this with a door. Let's but say you've got take a teammate it not serious. being chased Everybody by a monster a rushing towards Dog. the ship, and you've got two choices. Close the door and let your teammate die, but keep yourself and all your other teammates safe Or open the door the and risk it. Close it on, Digi. <laughs> oh no, get on top. <laughs> or alternatively, open the door for your sprinting uh -huh. teammate to potentially save his life, but run the risk of the monster getting inside and killing all of you. Open up, or just let them go. Open up, 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 open why did you bring the bees? This is a major reason why Lethal Company is incredible. Because weighing risks and constantly making life or death decisions for both you and your teammates yeah. is always exciting. Oh, here they, they come, here they come, here they come, here they come. I don't trust my friends in my life. Hurry up. Oh, he left him behind. He left Gary behind. Oh, no. Oh, no. I think it's beneficial to have some pessimists on the team that may be a little negative, but also mask. keep your feet on the ground with pragmatic decision making, especially with credit spending. Did you, did you spend 500 fucking dollars <laughs> on a jetpack? But you jet can't forget that, to balance sure. out these negative players with hopeful optimists that bring enough energy and levity to keep the whole team going. I'm ready to work for minimum wage. The teamwork dynamic radically changes if you have the big lobby mod enabled, which is extremely oh, yeah, popular people, yeah. and changes the team from a max of four players to four. 40 players and the more players you can't have, the less teamwork is important if you have a, a lot regular map exceeding 10 Why players it it's gonna feel like you picked up an entire menards worth of contract i've never actually been to, way to that move <laughs> smoking on the menards <laughs> two by four <laughs> bro menards two by fours aren't two by fours anymore they're 1.5 by 3.5 so <laughs> isn't that actually <laughs> how most of them are day. i do this shit for a living oh, yeah, so yeah, so yeah, yeah, so who is in this Ship right now. Thinking about it, uh, everything changes when you go beyond the default four players. A horror game oh, is as much of a horror game when you outnumber the monsters everything. and all you can hear is chatter about George W. Bush. <laughs> <laughs> What? <laughs> Why is it so Yo, what were you Hello? saying about George Bush Growls? earlier before you cut off? I was talking about my morning ritual. Uh, every morning, I wake up, I salute the flag, oh, I take a shit, get something. out of bed, <laughs> and then I I kiss a photo of George Bush every morning. Herschel Walker and W. It's about time Herschel we got Walker? to the monsters anyway, because thought, each one being unique adds Walker, yet another uh, layer of player. complexity and, quite frankly, fun, if you ask me. Oh! Oh, no. <laughs> Wait, somebody's on the Uh, <laughs> Freddy Fazbear. Day starts at what 8 a.m. And, and it's imperative that you move as fast as possible. Go, 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 go! 725 an hour, let's go! Let's go! Let's go! Let's go! Let's go! Let's go! If you ain't first, you're last. Get up the uh, ladder, boy! Because the ship will automatically leave you at behind midnight. at midnight, and as the day goes on, more and more monsters will spawn. Let's go. Yo, oh, is that a coil no, head? You might think you're built different yeah. after easy looting in the early game, Dude, Peter but once Griffin the sun laughed. goes down, your likelihood of getting G-checked by a monster goes way up. Mm -hmm. Damn, get I'm the good. Freak out of there. I'm built Giant. different, man. I'm built Giant. different. That's right. I made it. I'm built distinctly, bro. Oh. Damn. That's crazy. <laughs> the bees. Hi. He's dead. <laughs> Someone just said hi. Hi. <laughs> Die. That's actually happened to me at that exact same spot with the bees. The first monster to keep in mind, 
gravity. I'm willing to bet that gravity kills more interns than any other monster, and the number of times I get accused of pushing people is ridiculous. Oh shit! That, did they have the push mod? <laughs> I didn't what? push him. I mean, I guided him, but I didn't push him. <laughs> <laughs> Gary. I'm uh, sussy. I'm gonna be real. Okay, okay, fine, fuckface. Spell suspicious. <laughs> you cannot spell suspicious. Alright. S. Uh, you go first. Alright, you go first. E. Nope. <laughs> Turrets are self-explanatory, but mines have a little quirk. By this point, you've already seen so many deaths to landmines that they just aren't funny anymore. It's all... <laughs> They're always What's funny. What's interesting about them is that they don't detonate until you step off of them. You have to be on it. Oh. You have to be on it. So if you ever accidentally trigger one, you can save lives by getting your teammates can out you of the get, blast radius before you You can get teleported out of there, can't you? Some monsters you can negotiate with, like hoarding oh, no. that will completely leave you alone if you drop them loot. Hey, come here. Oh, is that really how it works? There you go. No, no, no. There, there. Get out of here. Goodbye. He's, see, he's excited. That was a good trade. It truly it was, does not matter what that, that loot much. is. Bada literally gave one a gun, and it immediately left him alone. I'm out of bullets. I'm out of bullets. Oh, let him take a I'm shotgun. Negotiate. Negotiate. <laughs> Negotiate. Get out, get out, get out, get out. Is that the actual fire exit? <laughs> okay, it is. I'm thinking that every monster can be negotiated with. Because if you try to pull that shit with Bracken, he may not be so amused. No, he's so not. I'm going to give him some Coca-Cola and we'll negotiate. <laughs> and gone. <laughs> Uh, that negotiation did not go well. is the most well. beloved entity in the game that prefers red to blue and is often modded to become Freddy Fazbear. Yeah. Alright, if you call him Freddy Rizbear again, I'm gonna ban you, Jim. That's... Oh my god, he's right there! Bear. Hey, what's up, my boy? Oh. <laughs> Bro, I summoned him. That was me. What was that, Nene? He'll snap your neck and drag your body back to his trap house if you get too close oh. or stare too long, but if you only glance at him, he'll just leave. Oh, okay. Okay. I see that I'm not alone anymore. Uh huh. Now I just leave. Okay. Okay. He's a tip towing. He shaded short. Senor Shannon Bracken, short. come out to play. Yay. No. Oh my God. Some monster interactions are just horseshit. Like the speed like, that a thumper can wave dash is nothing short oh. of a death sentence. I didn't know a thumper. Oh. What? What? Is that speed? I feel like Crazy Gary speed. would be so hyped about his movement. <laughs> and don't even get me started on the spooky no, girl. No, no. My, to my, understand her behavior could probably my least favorite oh, monster. Because children. <laughs> All right. So should I be scared or not? Yes. She's just breathing. Okay. Goodbye. She ran away because she's a scared little coward. See you later, chicken shit. Dumb mad child. She can get you outside. For the it's most part, bad. each monster has flaws for you to exploit. If you don't want to get eaten by a giant, make sure he doesn't see you. Uh huh. Giant. Oh, and if you don't goodbye. Want to get eaten by a dog, don't. make sure he doesn't hear you. Chad, I'm going to say it super quietly. What the dog doing? Oh, God. Oh, look at me. I proc on sound. Oh, he took great Stupid offense. Stupid ass to that. dog. <laughs> the more unique the monster's flaw, the Coil more head. unique the interaction. He hasn't talked about I them think before. Coilhead takes the cake for me. No, Dude, that was not gonna work. Out. No, Coilheads absolutely not. But can only move when you aren't. Are they actually out. invincible? So making sure one of your teammates is always making eye contact is crucial. Hold E and look quick. Well, why is it lame right there? Bring that up again is the best way to deal with them. But if you have a teammate nearby and you just don't tell them, that's also a solution. Uh huh. Uh, oh. Well, can you close doors on them? Oh, on the block? No, they open doors. All things can open doors. Oh sh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. He got out of there. Do not go in there. Go in. Do not. That's my favorite thing. Do not. That is. Go in. Why are things exploding? Do not go in there. That's my favorite. All right, I'm gonna go back to the ship. All right. My favorite thing is the right. whole. Uh... So, um, you want to talk about that? <laughs> sure. can, we, can we see it? <laughs> I do not. Counterintuitively, he can be even more dangerous with a large group because everybody else assumes that Someone somebody in, else but nobody will is. Because nobody wants to be stuck with him. You a whole what if I, bit. Um, oh wait. What if I went the other way. Fire escape. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit! Oh my god! <laughs> I got this. <laughs> the, the cut scream. Dude, proximity chat games are amazing. A single frame of that scream. If you prefer fight to flight, bashing monsters to death with shovels or stop signs is an option. Or shotgun. Hey, Why is the thumper not doing this anything? Strategy not is much there? more suited to a modded lobby with ten guys running around oh, than yeah. a default lobby with four. Get his ass, yeah, that would not. Oh, oh, fuck. 
Nice. This game was clearly designed as a runaway from the Monsters game. Absolutely. Not a Space Hulk, the Monsters run away from oh, me God. game. He is cooked. Uh -oh, oh, dude, giants are just, just so oh, fast. <laughs> That's a common joke. Tom and Jerry looking dude. ass deaf. All right, fuck, I'm gonna jump into the ocean. You guys Don't do that. Whee! <laughs> Plenty of monsters are invincible. Oh, cool. Most can have DPS at you, and it always feels mm -hmm. better to find the creative solution to the bad guy instead of trying to solve every problem with a stop sign. Will he take a whole ass large axle? I want to see him take anything. It. All right, all right, you ready? Wait, who? The loot box? Yeah, back up, back up. <laughs> oh, he took it! He took oh, goodbye. Okay, axle. he's very happy. <laughs> Is that the actual mod for the <laughs> loot bug or no? Happy about it. And you've already seen in this video that the scariest monsters are often your own teammates. Oh yeah, your it's friends. Also yeah, also common yeah. to have a commander, so to speak, who is somebody that stays behind on the ship to monitor the radar. And can also get hours, teleport players, and communicate on the radio. Get corpses, make sure I don't lose everything. The boat, having both great power and great responsibility. Let me drive the boat. His ass is being drained. Do not get in the keys. 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 The wheel. Let's Let's go. Go. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> because if they ever decide to take off early, it means a premature death for anybody yep. not on the ship. And I have never seen a group of interns so angry. For what reason? And they're about to leave the. We are aligning digital. They actually just left them. Get his ass. Get his ass. Oh, yeah, no. You are such you a stupid a moron. Do you know how much loot we had? We had thousands of loot. Digi, we're going to beat you to death with hammers. I hope you know that. I say that we revoke Digi's oxygen privileges. I, th I think that those need to go away. Oh, no. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, oh, okay. Well, I don't feel respected here. Why do I need reverb? Wait, where did you go? <laughs> you can't leave the disrespectful space. Final question I'm sure you're asking is lethal company scary? Yes. And the answer entirely depends on settings. If you were in the big lobby scary. mod like me and oh, it's not that scary. Have no. teammates around saying things like this, feeling an assault, but the ketchup, a little bit of poop. Uh, what? The usual. No. The usual. It's not scary. I don't know about you jack that up being your usual. brightness like I see a ton of people do. No, it's not a scary game. But if oh you're my, playing that default makes so much four easier. player regular vanilla, I think it shows how brilliant and scary, or at the very least unsettling, the game is. I never thought I'd unironically say this word, but the reason why is immersion. I know Skulker is about to bully me and tell oh, me no. I smell like beans for saying that word, but hear me out. You're playing the KV2, you smell like fucking beans, dog. <laughs> the KV2? <laughs> Dude, I love my KV2. Yeah. Wait a minute. Unlike a Discord call, that which feels flat to and 2D, like ass. proximity voice chat in this game makes it feel 3D with both distance and direction. Oh, you're above me. You're up there. <laughs> <laughs> that was fucking haunting. Mm -hmm. You don't know. Yeah. Better word, you are above, immersed below, in this world around. with 3D surround sound that temporarily tricks you into feeling like you are in a place talking oh, to other people. But somebody could be so far behind a locked door. <laughs> Hey. Up, the moment I realized this was brilliant was the moment it was taken away from me. I was deep in the facility Silence. down a labyrinth of hallways and my flashlight was almost dead. But like it's getting kind of late, fellas, and I'm running out of battery. I called out for help from my teammates, no one. but I was met with silence. That's so what I tried the radio right. instead. Let's try this. Can anybody help me get out of the facility? I'm just totally lost. Are you the last one? Hello? Oh, no. I have never felt so completely alone in my entire in, life. Scared. You get so yeah. comfortable saying things out loud and hearing things said back in a 3D space. And then space you're that just you alone and lost in the dark. And don't hear anything back, it is haunting. Your flashlight is dead, the night is getting darker, and the only noises you can hear are around. monsters approaching you from all angles. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'm hearing big movement. Honestly, at this point, he didn't see me. No, you didn't see me. You didn't see me. Just leave uh, the facility, Badger. He's, he's what do lost. you think I'm trying to do? I can't find my way out. Not even a fire exit. Oh! <laughs> that was fast. <laughs> okay. <laughs> that oh, was God. such a labyrinth, there was no way that I was finding yeah, my way out. No. That is how Lethal Company can be scary Being and what alone. makes it so brilliant. When you are around others, the game really There's makes the creators, you feel like uh, around others. Uh, enjoy <laughs> life, I'd say. Shit, bro. Like, I don't keep up. I just, I just hit retweet and I keep scrolling. <laughs>
<laughs> when you are by yourself, the game really makes you feel like you are by yourself. We are talking 100% mm -hmm. forever alone. You are a dead man walking that they will never find. Intern 84. I am blown away that this game was made by one guy, and you won't understand the true extent of his goofy creativity. A, he didn't talk about the mask. Yourself. Press B on things. I started playing. It was amazing. I eat it, and it disappears. <laughs> he didn't even talk about the mask. Don't mass, eat the toilet either. That's just gross. <laughs> no. <laughs> I'm excited to see how Lethal Company evolves in the future because since I started making this video, there's been a major uh -huh. update and a oh, mountain wait, of mods that added to this game. That's so many mods. Yeah, no, the the Smitty videos have like oh my ruined God. my sense of the introduction of the Devil Lethal Barrel Company. Match before another one today has completely changed the game. This one item suddenly makes every crewmate more dangerous than a police officer hearing a falling acorn. Got a gun. Got a gun. <laughs> I get that meme. Oh my god. Damn. Damn. I don't know why, but having this thing around crewmates is like a PDF around boomers. People are gonna die. I guarantee it. That's actually a PDF. the key to just conquering boomers. Ask them to sign a PDF digitally, they just die. I asked a boomer to sign a PDF for me and he pulled out an electron microscope. <laughs> Adding a gun to the game may not sound like a big shift, but it has the ability to transform trustworthy crewmates into homicidal mm -hmm. maniacs. Right, you gotta, you gotta show it. Oh seven. <laughs> oh, wait, that get both of them? Is that there's a new item the called mask. a dramatic okay. mask that is specifically is. designed for this purpose of turning teammates evil. As in, if you hold it up to your face, you can literally turn into a monster that attacks your teammates. And also like mimics yeah. how you play and move. So on the map, you look like you are still alive. <laughs> And even that thing is far less dangerous than a teammate with a shotgun in his hand. Uh huh. I got five copies of the. Because you kind of trust the teammate with a shotgun. <laughs> God. In the hands of a reasonable teammate, the outcomes are incredibly positive because the ability to kill a monster in a split second will get you Can out you of the jam and save lives. So putting the power of God in the hands of an unreasonable teammate, the outcomes may not be so positive. You know what? I don't even care. I eat bullets. I don't give a fuck. Let me have it. Five seven by twenty eight nine mil. I just had to G-check him on the head. <laughs> the shotgun just talks to me sometimes. You can't blame it on me. Uh -huh. Please, give me the shotgun. I'm normal. I can be trusted with the uh -huh. double barrel shotgun when my teammates are unarmed. When no one would suspect the thing. I have a gun. Little girls aren't good against guns. Uh, no, 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 no. Only I can see her, and when she reaches me, my head is full. Well, there we go. She reached him. I just wanted to tell him that I would solve his problem so badly. There's even a safety mechanic on this thing because for when some it's reason there's a safety. With the safety off, it can randomly fire. And what? None of us agreed on safety rules. What happened? I did not know that. So my safety was on and I didn't manage to shoot, but thankfully Mickey saved me. Hey, you can just hey, never turn the safety bye. on. That solves your problem. Safety. Always off. What? I am a responsible. Uh, uh, yeah. I make it back. Oh no! I do that. great. The <laughs> <laughs> what just happened? The the corpse ragdolling. Sigrid just executed. Sigrid is like locked the fuck in. Oh she was not tolerating any tomfoolery. Mm -hmm. All right. Sigrid oh is so locked in. Like, oh. That was okay. Awesome. Shit. Yeah. Bro just appeared. <laughs> Wait, did it just hit him? Oh, no. I was so fucking locked in. <laughs> Sigrid, you fucking oh, shot me in the back of the head. If you were any more locked in, it would be considered a prison sentence. What makes this especially dangerous is that the spread on this bad boy is massive. Uh, and it has no problem slapping multiple targets at once. Okay. It does so much damage. <laughs> yeah. What the fuck? Damn, somebody killed me. And that is why at a gun range, you stand February, behind the barrel. The mods the barrel. can definitely enhance or weaken the experience depending on your perspective. Like cosmetics and emotes are just fine. What is gorilla? Oh, that's... <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> what do you think? Me when I see my ops. <laughs> <laughs> but if you turn on the wrong mod, like Brutal Company, what is Brutal Company? Everything. Bruh, bruh. Yeah. Pasta doesn't know that there's gonna be a mine under his feet in three, two, one, and. Why was there a mine under? His... Wait, is that is that just a thing? Execution. It may be funny for a round or two, and it may make Twitch chat laugh, but that's only because you've made the game impossible. Yeah, you, that doesn't sound like you can even win that. And a mine. Oh my god, Chad. That's probably the scariest thing. Don't get happen. I'm strongly in favor of pushing the bounds of what's possible in a game and limit testing the mod, to the end of the game. We must limit test. <laughs> 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 
world star? Yeah. <laughs> you just yell world star? But there comes a point where too much is too much. Like if you find yourself in a game where you can always hear other people talking, no matter it's your not position be scary. on the map, the big lobby mod has gone too far. Uh, we can hear y'all through the bookcase. <laughs> yeah, we can. As soon as I think Gary's too far away to be heard, I just hear, huh? <laughs> yeah, it's like, oh, well, I probably can't hear him when somebody says Instead something. Or when you say hello 20, and somebody says. games of 10, four games of five, five games of four. You do the math. I think I've made my point on the mods. If you really want to squeeze the fun out of this game, less is more. This is just Gary. I don't care what you tell me. Yeah. This is Gary. That's Gary. <laughs> I think Gary's watching my videos. I those of you on Twitch enough wow. for helping me make this video. From the subs to the bits to the jokes. So I far. used my neural link to exterminate every Kia Soul owner in existence. <laughs> Why do you hate the Kia Soul so much? That makes no sense. Damn, I don't want Chad to get a neural link. If Chad ever gets a hold of a neural link, it's over. Mm -hmm. Kia Souls are built like Kingpin from Spider Verse. I stream two hours a day, six days a week now, and having thousands wow, I of stream screaming at me about two my hours, busted four ass times. hairline really is a dream come true. Do not forget about the Swouse merch at Swouse. the link below. It's only available for the next 14 days, and it's a great way to support I these need, videos need, while uh, also making sure you pass the fit check. Was it Swouse.com? Shout out to Zeekers for reminding me what kind of power Swouse. an individual has in 2024. The fact that Lethal Company Swouse was made merch. by a single person blows oh, my mind. Oh, it's on mind, And I've never spent a better $10 in my entire life. <laughs> I'm gonna die. If I had two bullets and I had Hitler, Stalin, and Digi in front of me, I'd shoot Digi twice. <laughs> What's wrong with Digi? Digi? Flat. Why is my life? Constantly going downhill. <laughs> uh, um, um. Okay, where? What is? What is this hatch actually for? All right, there he goes. What? The the, hell? Yeah, you just die. Yeah. <laughs> Does the jetpack come Why back down? Do that? <laughs> <laughs> I read the directions oh, on the jetpack. It said we fly shit. high, no uh, lie. And yeah, you flew it, a little too high. The thing I have to say is thank you for watching all the way to the end of my video. I really hope it defied your expectations. Thank you for hearing me out on the merch, and I am so excited to see what the next video looks like. I, does he say what it's going to be? Know, it's Helldivers 2, but I am so oh, excited to start that video. Another, that game fun. I know Once nothing again, about. Thank you so much. You guys give me the greatest job in the whole just like world. I went, I just how I went in the Leafer Company? I have no idea. I just wanted to make a weird noise just to like really mark the end of the video, and I I guess that worked. Okay. Well, this is gonna be muted just because it always if I if it wasn't muted, it would get copyright claimed as soon as the video goes live. Even though it's at the end of the video, three minutes after the video goes live, it'll get uh it'll get copyrighted, which is just not fun. Hey look, Demolition Ranch. One minute ago. Oh my god. Too bad I have to record three more videos today. Some of them being really, really long. But this was uh, his Leap the Company video. The next one's gonna be Hell Divers. I could not tell you a single thing about Hell Divers. I believe it's is it a co-op game or is it a single player game? I'm not really sure. I know you're not you're not playing against anybody. You're playing against like the computer. So I don't know. I don't know if like there's gonna drop video. I think Maxer maybe dropped the Helldivers video. I, I knew nothing about it. Just like I win the Lethal Company, having absolutely no idea. Like I said, you could definitely check out that two hour long Lithera video where Paper Box House, I'm pretty sure, was in it. Uh, Gary, I'm sure, was in it as well. Um, who were in this video. I'm surprised Lithera didn't make an appearance in this one. He was probably playing the Silver Campaign. That might have been the issue. Uh, but I really hope you enjoyed this video. I look forward to the next one. I hope you have a wonderful rest of the day. But until next video, take care and keep the music.